later in this video. Falling! Wait, where's Majesty? Isn't she always, like, right there? Yeah, our rings glow, we poof in, Majesty's across from us. I don't understand. And then she always goes... Ladies, focus, I have a mission for you. <laughs> I love your shape-shifting powers, Flash. Shape-shift into me next. Oh! Ah! Good one, Majesty. Why did you scare us like that? <laughs> Sorry, ladies. We wanted to prepare you. Prepare us for what? I'm dispatching you all to the county fair. Celeste has detected bungler activity, and Cheshire and I suspect that it might be the crazy jester. It could be nothing, but we want you to be there to keep an eye out on things. Undercover, of course. <laughs> that sounds awesome, but what does that have to do with scaring us? Well, we think that the Jester might be going to the fair's fun house. Whatever you want, Majesty. Um, but we were actually hoping to go to the school dance tonight. Yeah, the boys even bought matching suits to match our dresses. And I even have a date. No feeling like a seventh wheel this time. Just to clarify, they are going with their boyfriends. I am going solo. Well, why don't we all go to the fair first to check it out and then we all go to the dance? Oh yeah, great idea. Oh, wait, Glow, who are you going with? Oh, there's this cute guy in my science class. We're doing a project together. <gasps> Perfect! Oh, I can't wait to meet him. Guess that leaves just me and you, Flash. I have the perfect suit to match your dress. Uh-huh. Have fun, everyone. And may destiny always be on your side. Whoa, this fair is huge! Is that a bouncy house? Oh, I love this! Our county fair is an American tradition? Yep, we love any excuse to eat popcorn and win prizes. And ride roller coasters! I love roller coasters! What do you want to do, Kai? Well, I definitely want to go to the dance later, but uh, how about some bumper cars? <laughs> Wait, you guys! The Jester, she's here! Who? Uh, bad news, Kai. We kind of need to split up for a little while and just take care of some official business. What kind of business? Uh, official school paper business, right girls? Right. Oh, let us know if you need any help with that. No, I, I mean, no, it's not a big deal. It's just, um, but... Uh, let's all split up. You girls take care of that and we'll go ride the Twister. Twister! <laughs> Uh, the, the, the twister, doesn't that go up really, really high? Hey, you'll be fine. Come on, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's pitch black in here. How are we supposed to see the jester's shadow? I got this. <laughs> really? I can't help it. It gets me every time. Oh, shake it out. Shake it out. Hey, super freaks. Guess what time it is? Uh... Jester time? Nope! Time for yous to get a watch! I was pointing to an empty wrist! Die! Oh. Actually, I think it's Super Pops time. Ready? Super Pops, we can't be stopped! That's better. What are you up to now, Jester? I just wanted to play a little game with ya! It's called the Date Night Challenge! Where you all have to spend 24 hours in the fair with your boyfriends! <laughs> uh, that's the challenge? Okay, what's so hard about that? Well, uh, yeah! So, uh, the way it works is you have to answer eight rounds of riddles, and if any one of you answers incorrectly or wrong, I guess that means the same thing, but if you answer wrong, I will reveal your true identities to the entire county fair! <laughs> <gasps> you can't reveal our identities. Try me! <laughs> I will. Wait, 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 wait. 
guy doesn't know that we're Super Pops, how are we supposed to play a challenge with him without revealing who we are? That's not my problem! Oh, and just so you Super Dogs know, you'll be playing the challenge as Super Pops, but with no superpowers! <laughs> it's a battle of wits! What? And you can keep the gowns as a consolation prize! They don't look so half bad, they're kind of fancy and don't look like garbage compared to your Super Pops outfits! <laughs> Rude. Hope you're ready to say goodbye to your little secret identities! <laughs> Just get here? Wait! You're a super pop! What are you doing here? Oh, hey Kai. You don't remember waiting in line to ride the uh old rickety roller coaster? Oh, right. Uh I'm supposed to be on a date with my friend Gia. Have you seen her? Uh Gia is afraid of roller coasters. That's weird. Earlier she said she loves them. Did I say afraid? I, I meant she went to get a drink and um, she'll be back to meet up with you later. Wait, how do you know so much about Gia? Uh, we used to go to school together. Okay, that's awesome. Janelle, yep, Janelle, uh, right, that sounds mighty good, <clears throat> I'm your friendly county fair riddle teller, hope y'all are ready for some fun riddles. County fair riddle teller? Oh, yeah, I saw it advertised on a poster as we were walking in. If you get most of the answers right, you get some kind of cool secret prize. Wanna play? Sure! I hope I'm good at riddles. First riddle up! This goes out to our roller coaster riders. You see me once in June, twice in November, but not at all in May. What am I? Once in June, twice in November, but not at all in May. I wonder if it has anything to do with the solstice? The soul what? No, I think it has something to do with the spelling of the names. Oh my gosh, Kai, you're right! The answer is the letter E! Ah! Yeah, alright, the roller coaster dweebs got it! Beginner's luck! Have fun falling! Falling? Kind of exciting. It's like you never know it's gonna pop out at you. Who are you? What? Oh, nothing. Second riddle is for anyone hanging out in the haunted house. Tom's father has three sons Jim, John, and what's the third one's name? Three sons. Hmm. John, Jacob, Jingleheimer, Schmidt. His name is my name, too. Is there something there? Is there something there? Wait, wait, wait. Cosmic, do you remember the first part? Um... Can you repeat the question, please? Wow! Way to go! Uh, um, um, I mean, uh, I mean, sure. Tom's father has three sons. Jim? Wait, Tom's father? Tom is the son! Nice work! Frady cats? Ha, huh, Frady what? <laughs> okay, a, a Ferris wheel. That's not too bad. At least it's not a roller coaster. <laughs> I hate roller coasters, but mostly I'm just afraid of heights. All right, okay. I'm just, I'm just gonna close my eyes. Oh no. Okay, I'm sorry, James. Let's just get through this riddle really fast. <laughs> hey, y'all, Ferris wheelers. My third riddle is for you all. What has legs but doesn't walk? Hmm, okay. 
So if it doesn't have legs, it's probably not alive. What else has legs? That's it. Ah, uh, what? what? What's it? Chairs and tables have legs. A table? Really? Oh, I mean, that was fast. Great job. Enjoy your ride. Yes, we did it. High five. Blimey. This is so romantic. I never really understood the love boat ride. I mean, you're just floating down a man-made river in a plastic boat. Like, what's so romantic about that, right? Well, maybe it means more when you're with somebody you care about. Um... <laughs> or maybe it's just a bunch of hocus pocus they try to sell you. I mean, nothing even happens on this ride. Flash? Hey, lovebirds. Here comes my fourth riddle. There's a one-story house where everything is yellow. The walls are yellow, the doors are yellow, even all the furniture is yellow. What color are the stairs? Well, obviously they're not yellow. Oh, are you sure? Are you joking? No. That would be way too obvious. <laughs> yes, yes, yes I am. I mean, what color are they then? Are they invisible, yellow, blue? I mean, she said a one-story house that everything's yellow and... Uh, Wait, a one-story house? One-story houses don't have stairs. Seriously? <gasps> yep, that's right. Y you all are correct. <gasps> yes! <laughs> um, Glow, are you ready to write something else now? I, uh, I think we might be stuck until this boyfriend child, mm, until we solve the final riddle. Oh, this is an intense county fair. Back to the roller coaster kitties. My fifth riddle is for you. Which is heavier, a ton of bricks or a ton of feathers? Uh, neither. They both weigh a ton. They're, they're the same weight, duh. Whoa, Kai. <laughs> That was very impressive! Thanks! Try not to fall for me though. I have my eyes set on your friend Gia. Really? Okay, alright. I mean, well done! Oh, we got it right! Alright! Time for your sixth riddle! And I'm not taking it easy on you, Pop. I mean, fair goers! Anymore. Okay, this is round six. The jester said there would be eight rounds. We're almost done. The other couples must be doing good. Hopefully, but I won the lottery with the perfect partner. <coughs> what has hands but can't clap? Okay, okay, let's think about this. Hands, hands, what has a, a seal? A seal doesn't have hands. Oh, wait, no, but they, they do clap. I've seen them in shows. Okay, keep thinking, keep it. Dolls, dolls. Uh, is it like a, a play on words, like a, like a stage hand? Wait, a clock has hands. That's gotta be it, a clock. Ding, 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 you're right. Ah! Yes. Yeah. Spike and Chloe. For the win. For the win. Yeah. We're awesome. I mean cosmic, I mean cosmic. Oops. Riddle seven. What's bright orange with green on top and sounds like a parrot? Bright orange. Oh, this question was made for glow. I hope I do her justice. With green on top and sounds like a parrot. What, what do parrots sound like? A caw caw! Probably want a cracker. Wait, James, what rhymes with parrot? Merit, ferret. Uh, carrot. Ca carrot? Carrots are bright orange with green on top. Our answer is carrot. Carrot? Are you kidding me? You're a lot smarter than I thought. So, if you were going to go on a love boat for real, would you? Uh, I mean, maybe if I had someone special, but there's not really anyone in my life who likes me like that, so. Who wouldn't like you, Finn? You're funny and, and and sassy and smart and cool. Anybody would be lucky to be with you. Thanks, Cheshire. It's round eight, chickadees. <laughs> round eight? That means nobody's lost yet. It's the final round. We got this. What can you break even if you 
never pick it up or touch it. Wait, hasn't Cosmic broken a few things with her telekinesis powers? Wait, does that count? Okay, let's think. Um, you can break a bond, you can uh, break a sweat, you, uh, you can break bread. There are just so many options. Is that your final answer? Oh, what? No, we were just thinking out loud. I don't, oh. eh, wrong answer. The correct answer is a promise. You know, like how you promise to do what's good and right. Keep your true selves out of sight. <laughs> Whoops. Oh no, my identity. Attention. All y'all county favors, I have a very important announcement to make. Oh no. We have an incredibly important guest here tonight. No, Flash and Cheshire must have gotten theirs wrong. <gasps> We've got to save her. And it is my pleasure to announce her full name for the first Electra, can you stop her? Um, I, I don't know. I have to think of an idea. Ladies and gentlemen, the true identity of Flash Pop, Miss Finley Pop! <laughs> Wait, what happened to the speaker? Oh, um, there must have been some kind of shortage. It looks like this ride is done, so you should probably meet up with your friends. Oh yeah, cool. Hey, do you want to go to the school dance with us? Oh, I'll be fine, but um, will you tell Gia that I said hi? Whew, that was close. Yeah, we almost lost that riddle game in front of everyone. Right, the riddle game, yeah. Oh boy, that would have been so embarrassing. Let's go to the dance! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Gia, uh, the weirdest thing happened. I was stuck on the Ferris wheel with the Super Pop, and, and, and she, she said she knows you too. What a small world. Do you want to see more fun challenges like this one? Be sure to subscribe. And, and hit, hit that, that like button. button. <laughs> and turn your bell notifications on so you never miss a video. Uh, turn on what? Who are you all talking to? Uh, no one. Nope, no one. Don't, don't worry about it. <clears throat>